know, this is your time. Absolutely. I'm not just saying this to be saying this, but this is really your season. And guess what? This is your moment. I want to let you know you are destined for greatness. You can accomplish anything. I want you to know that anything is possible. You are, let me tell you this. I want to tell the whole world. I get in front of this camera for free every single day because I love you all and I believe in you all and I am your life coach, your motivator, your inspirator, and your life coach and your mindset coach. I want to let you know you are greatness. You are destined for greatness. Come on, let me tell you something. I am in London. I am in Bermuda. I am in Australia. I am in ABA. I am in the NFL. I am in corporate. Wow, I'm going to the NBA. I'm going to the NFL. I'm going to Bermuda. I'm going to London. I am international. I am in corporate. Why? Because I believe in myself. And this is the place. I want to use this motivational video today to get you to believe in yourself. I want you to get to a place to where you know that you are greatness. You are a diamond. But let me say this. In order to become a diamond, every diamond, you see how expensive diamonds are. You see how beautiful diamonds are. They're some of the most beautiful jewelry. But let me tell you something. To, in order to become a diamond, listen to me very closely. In order to become a diamond, you must go through extreme pressure. I think I need to say that again. Before you, before a diamond becomes a diamond, listen to me very closely. A diamond, before it becomes a diamond, it must go through extreme, extreme pressure. Let me tell you something. This is how you tell the real diamonds from the fake diamonds. Whenever you cut them, whenever you put the pressure on them. So what do you mean? This is going to determine the people who want it, who want it the most, apart from the people that don't want it the most. Whenever life hits you, whenever you start going through, whenever you start going through situations, the ones that are going to quit, you're going to be able to tell they're not the real diamonds. But the people that are the diamonds are the ones that can be that can lose a loved one and they'll still keep going. The ones that can get sick, they'll keep going. The athlete that gets injured and they don't give up on their career. The person that goes through the divorce, but they don't give up. The person that has a mental illness and depressed, they won't give up. The person who has the bad past, but they still keep going after their dreams. They're going through all this extreme pressure. The ones that is going through all of this extreme pressure of life, and they're still going after their dreams in the midst of what they're going through. That's the diamond. The, the person that is the diamond, they can go through everything in life. They can have all the problems, but they're still putting in 120%. They're still going beast mode, lion mode, blood, blood, sweat, tears. They're still going after their dreams. That's the diamond. Are you going to be the diamond that will go through the pressure? Are you going to be a person that no matter what you're going to, you're not going to quit? You're not going to give up? You can win that Super Bowl. You can win the NCAA championship. You can win the World Series. You can win the World Cup. You can win the Olympic gold medal. You can win the high school state championship. You can get that doctoral degree. You can get that PhD. You can write that book. You can be a speaker. You can be a doctor. Lawyer, you could be a movie producer, you could be a rapper, a singer, I don't know, you could be a real estate investor, but you are greatness. You can be whatever you want to be. Listen, I know the pain, the hurt, and scars in your life are real. I'm gonna say that again. I know the pain, the hurt, and the scars in your life are real, but you are not what you're going through. Man, listen, maybe I'm talking to somebody that's going through a hard time. Maybe I'm talking to someone who is going through a difficult time in your life right now. Let me tell you something. You are not what you are going through. The mental pain, the emotional pain, I know it's tough, but you will come through it. You will win. You will prevail. So the question becomes, 
What does prevail mean? Prevail means to be victorious. And I have great news for you. You will be victorious. I have great news for you. You are victorious. You shall prevail. You are greatness. Anything is possible. Listen, let me tell you my story. I went from flunking in first grade. I was labeled as retarded. I was bullied in school. I had a reading and comprehension problem. I had a learning disability. I failed the first grade. When I got in high school, listen, my high school teacher told everybody else how great they were going to be. But when she got to me, she said, Tommy, you're not smart enough to go to college. She said, Tommy, you're not going to graduate high school. She said, you might as well go to the military or go work in a factory. Well, I almost listened to her. I took the military test and I flunked the military test. And then watch this, I finally got in college. But listen, it didn't stop there. I kept going, see, I know what it's like to suffer. I know what it's like to go through emotional pain. I have been there and that's why I'm qualified to help you get through what you're going through. That's why I'm qualified as a life coach. That's why I'm qualified as a motivational speaker because I have been there and I have prevailed. I have overcome everything. Listen, I finally got in college, but I got sick. I had a nervous breakdown, and I was hospitalized for a whole year. And guess what? I flunked out of college. It seemed like my life was over, but I got back in on academic probation. Then I was innocently shot multiple times and pronounced dead at the hospital. Then in 2009, I became homeless, living on the streets with nowhere to live. And now I am a nominee for the Nobel Peace Prize Award. I am a nominee for the Talbert Eliasson Global Leadership Prize Award. And now, I am a published author of four self-help motivational books. And now, I am a life coach and a mindset coach and a motivational speaker changing lives. Why? Because I believe in myself. And that's going to be you. If you are going to be successful, and creating, watch this, I'm teaching today, I want to teach. If you are going to be successful in creating a great life for yourself, you must believe you can make it happen. You must believe you can create that great life. You must believe you can do it. You must believe you can achieve it. You must believe you can accomplish it. You have to believe you have everything on the inside of you to become wealthy and successful. I'm going to say that again. You have to believe you have everything on the inside of you to become wealthy and successful. And I'm just here today to spread some love to you. I want to spread some inspiration to you. I want to spread some love to you. I want you to know how much I love you. I want you to know how much I care about you. And I want you to know you can do it. You can be a happy billionaire. You can be a happy multi-millionaire. You can come up with that billion dollar idea. You can, be, you can become successful. You can accomplish your dreams. You can be the CEO of that company. You can start that business. You can become an artist. You can write that book. You can do whatever you want to do. You are greatness. But you must believe in yourself. You must know you can do it. I'm going to say that again. You must believe in yourself. You must know you can do it. You must have self-esteem, self-confidence, and self-assurance. If you have self-esteem, if you have self-confidence, if you have self-assurance, and if you believe in yourself, you will achieve greatness. You will accomplish anything you want to accomplish. I'm closing. You must believe deeply within your mind that you can accomplish anything. I'm closing. You must believe in your gifts, your abilities, your talents, and skills, watch this, to create the great life you want to live. I'm closing on this. To believe in yourself. To believe in yourself. Walk with me now. Walk with me. Watch this now. To believe in yourself is a choice. Ooh, I'm going to say that again. 
To believe in yourself is a choice. You must make the conscious decision that you are going to believe in yourself. Other people may doubt you. Other people may sleep on you. Other people may not believe in you. But you must make the choice to believe in yourself. You must make the choice and decide to believe in yourself. You are greatness. You are destined for greatness. You can do it. You can be it. And you can accomplish it. Greatness. The eye of a tiger. But you must have the mindset of a lion. Do you want to chase that gazelle? Do you want that gazelle? Let me tell you something. The thing about a lion is when a gazelle is hurt and it's not running, a lion won't even chase it. I did my research. But when that gazelle is running, that lion is ready to go after that gazelle. Why? Because that lion is up for a challenge. Lions, let me tell you something about a lion. Lions are wired differently. And like the great Dr. Eric Thomas says, everybody wants to be a beast until it's time to do what beasts do. Let's, let me tell you something. When people, when students go to college, when students go to high school, when students go to school, every one of the students, every last one of the students, they say they want to make straight A's. They say they want to make a 4.0 GPA. But what happens at the end of the, end of, end of the school year? What is, your, what is your GPA at the end of the school year? Every, bat, every sports team say they want to win the championship. Every sports team say they want to have a winning season. But at the end of the end of the season, what is your what is their record at the end of the season? When it's time for the playoffs, when it's time for the championship, who is in the playoffs? Who is at the championship game? Why? Because everybody want to be a beast until it's time to do a beast too. Everybody say they want to win a championship until it's time to go to the championship. Everybody say they want to go to the playoffs and we want to see who's going to be in the playoffs. What do you mean, Dr. Campbell? Talk is cheap. How bad do you want it? If you want to succeed as bad as you want to live, then you'll be successful. How bad do you want to live? How bad do you want it? If you want to succeed as bad as you want to live, then you'll be successful. How bad do you want to live? How bad do you want it? How bad do you want to write that book? How bad do you want to be a doctor? How bad do you want to be a billionaire? How bad do you want to be a multi-millionaire? How bad do you want to start that business? How bad do you want to be the CEO of that company? How bad do you want to be a lawyer or a doctor, tennis player, soccer player, real estate investor? My point is this, and I'm closing. How bad do you want to be what you said you want to be? How bad do you want to do what you said you want to do? How bad do you want it? Please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Please spread the word about me all over social media as a motivational speaker. Please click the bell. Listen, I want to tell the whole world, I love you and I believe in you. This is your time. This is your season. And this is your moment.